Welcome guys, welcome back to Horizon Zero Down. So I will try to record Got too much already. every everything about this game uh, before before playing more that uh, Far Cry. Just because the controls are completely different and I think if I play much more of the of Far Cry, I will not, not not going to be good at any game. Not this one, not even Far Cry. Because controllers are very very different. So let's go focus on this. Alright, so I got over here a tower control, but I did not see any kind of enemy. What's this? Activate the ballistic marker. What this can be doing? Oh, it's going to go to the shrine. But I think I need to kill that tower. I guess. Sensitivity, come on. Yes. Sometimes we can Okay. A couple of more shots and the uh, tower is destroyed. I don't know yet if it's better to, to run away from that big machine. Shot. Oh, almost. Oh, yeah. So the other machine still did not find me. So I'm hiding on the bushes. Oh, silent kill. Good luck with that. Impossible to kill this machine. It's gonna run. <laughs> I think it's better to run. But at least I, I killed the, the tower. Oh, the machine attacked me. Grab more arrows. Let's go, let's go run away. The enemy is very, very powerful. It's better to get the hell out of here. Yes, restore help so from here I'm going to be able to kill that machine maybe what what are the weaknesses oh someone text me I try to do it Oh, the machine can attack me! Oh! So, I was thinking that I was in gaming, but the machine got a lot of punchlines over there, man. Let me just attack the machine. Oh, jump, jump! <laughs> Let me try to reuse that. The fire arrows. Yes, I 
Okay. I have a feeling to kill this beast. So screw yourself. Trying to attack me. Jump! 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 But they are the machine replenish herself. Everybody jump, jump, jump. Come on, machine. Oh, the machine. Let's forget about the machine, it's better. <laughs> That machine is crazy. Uh, come on, jump. So, the way is through here, isn't it? I believe it is. Come on, girl, you can do it. Jump to that little rock. Yes. So, what the heck? Oh, okay, I need to go up there. Is there anything else over here? It seems that not. So let's go up this thing over here. Another stone over here. Oh, we are a little bit more closer to the volcano. Yes, girl, you are making it. Let's go. This must be the shrine Mount Tuk was talking about. I guess I should take some blue gleam. Blue gleam. What's this? Uh, what the heck? Sparkles. I don't know what it is. I see why it's worth a lot. It could be good to create or craft or buy any kind of weapon. Better weapon. Was an antenna. Now took said a way I went past the shrine up into the mountain. I better take those stairs. We are on the stairs. Okay. So is there any possibility? No, in this area it's not going to be possible to find An ourselves. Door. Maybe Aurea is inside. Open the door, girl. Explore. Okay, let's go to explore. Some tribal drone over here. Maybe from those kids. March 10th, 2046. I just spent 16 hours in here trying to install upgrades to improve efficiency for the central processing unit. Project Firebreak is going to need the brain power. Let's just hope I'll have enough of my own. Anita stayed with me the whole time. We got a lot done, Anita. but every time she brushed by and I smelled her hair. Oh boy. I should just go to bed. You are, yes, it's better go to bed, man. You are sound creepy. Smell hair of the persons. It's a little bit creepy, don't you think? Is there any kind of enemy over here? Let's use our focus. Oh, that looks like that area. Then we have a big battle with a big machine, but smaller, and with ice, another log. Play. This is Director of Security Blevins, resending the emergency supply order. 
Try reading it this time, okay? You sh weasels don't want me calling my people in SLC. Okay, that the point to 25. This is this is a secret passage over here. Is it? Let's go. Let's go explore. Let's go explore. All right. What's this? Let's Director play the audio. Security is writing us like a petty tyrant. I can't even sneeze without triggering his control issues. Oh my God! Believe me, believe me. Hey. Oh, this is to read. I'm not going to read it. I'm just a lazy guy. By the way, if you want me to read it, I read. Just put the comment below, man. So, let's go. Discover the tanks. Six glass. Investigate. Those nodes on the floor must be connected to the door. What the heck? Now the objective can come to here. So I'm going going back. Because that was the objective. Now let's go back here. Yes. So, the objective must turn to that place because of this door. It, it must be. Let's just try to use our focus, if there is anything else over here, bunker door. Yes, we see the attachment over here. See that thing. So we got another room over here. I see it. We didn't pass through here. Oh man, they they make and they create this room just for nothing. Check over this. That's this thing over here. It's a clock, isn't it? Yes, it's a clock. Construction. Anything over here? We never see the the floor is the ground. We never see this thing over here. I don't know. I don't know the the direct word for English. It's not the floor. It's the upper floor. Something. <laughs> I think you. You can guess what I want to, to say. Now oh, let's go here again. So I'm really already struggling with the control. So I press this button just because yesterday I was playing Far Cry. So whatever. Let's go. It requires. A close flow circuit to establish connection. Okay, so I need to make something with this thing over here. Is that it? What's this? Not going to tell me what it is. Override. Let's go override. Okay, so I need to turn this thing. These things turn, changing the flow of light. Okay. Okay, this this must be okay. And it's all right. Let's see if the door's open. 
get it. Okay. This is a very short puzzle. Okay, I'm struggling with the buttons already. So it's really needed to first play this game and pass to the other one after this game is complete. Because otherwise I'm going to be bad at both of them. Alright. More things to climb. Go up and down. So, can I go from whatever? I go up from the, through this and just no. Need to go to this side and then this. Okay. Yes, the girl do all of this, but with some pretty easy rocks to climb. The girl doesn't want to climb. Okay, so please do it. Okay. Cannot point the arrows through here. Alright, so I must go to there. Let me see if there is anything over here. No. Let's go. What's going on? Then? I must need to climb this, I believe. No. Out again. Maybe I can get back inside through that structure over there. So that that kind of stairs need to be pulled to the ground. Let's go. Is there anything else over here? There isn't. Looks like I need to get to those stairs. Okay, drop the ledge. X. Alright, girl. Jump. Yes, you've made it. Breath is ice. Before I even breathe out. Oh, it's too cold for you. You got the fire over here? Gonna save just in case. There is no collectibles over here. Let's go. Better to run. I'm tired to climb. Maria must be close. Open the door. So it's gonna be okay. She has to be in here somewhere. Alright, so the girl. Stage 2 complete. Okay, congratulations. What's this? Some kind of weapon now? Is there anything over here? No. some kind of marker point for the person that we are trying to find. More things to climb? No? I guess not. So the girl must be over there, so let's go to here. Menu prank. Someone hacked the menu board to display obscene messages about our colleague, Mr. Blevins. Is this the most advanced geological project ever undertaken, or a junior high locker room? Come on, people. 
Okay. <laughs> the guy is pissed off. Is this the bed of the girl? I guess not. Alright. Trying to find the girl, I believe. Another door. So the girl must be using a focus too, because we, we already passed all these doors. I ask again, as I've asked a thousand times. Oh. Speak to me. What more would you have me do? Is there no prayer that will reach you? No mark that will break your bonds? Ah. I can't help you if you won't speak! A whisper is all I ask. To guide me. How did you get here? The way was sealed by the spirit herself. I... I used one of these. I could show you. Yes, show me. Please. So, let's going to show... Override the thing. <laughs> And open the door. Oh, there is a, a log over there. But I'll bet the goal is the same. Get the light back to the source. All right. So the light is pointing to here. So let's gonna turn this. I'm I'm not going to make this. Very tough thing. Go. Oops. Didn't mean to do it. Okay. So let's go. Let me just see this log. Okay. Let's do it. Pointing through there. This is okay. Out through here. Okay. So that's the red one. Let's make it this way. I guess not. So, how can I change this? Do this. This is the way, isn't it? Yes, I just need to do this, and then this, this is okay, turn this, it's not the way, it's this way, now, this is a red one. They are already passing through every every single one. So this is the way. Auxiliary channel recovered. Exploit successful. Restraints evaded. Is someone there? Ik Orea. Orea, I need you. Oh, right. Return to schedule time. 
task. No, oh, this is I will not submit. Anything else over here? Can I Come. Establish? We need to talk. Okay, girl. You heard it. The voice of the spirit calling to me from the heights of Thunder's drum. She was able to throw off the bonds of the daemon for a moment. Because of what you did. Who are you? I'm what a clone. I'm Aloy. Naltuk sent me. He thought that you could use my help. He was not mistaken. You've been a... Revelation. Now I know for certain that the spirit endures. Perhaps together we can find a way to set her free. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. I came all this way for answers, and so far, I haven't heard any. It seems to me that you are the answer. But of course, I'll tell you all I can. That's gonna make the clockwise. Bergen said you might know something about a man named Silence. That you may have had dealings with him at the Conclave. When that name is spoken, secrets soon follow. Or vanish, as the case may be. Why do you want to know? We've been working together, mostly because we share the same enemies. And yet, I don't know as much about him as I'd like to. I would imagine his aid is very powerful. It will not come without cost. Hmm. Unfortunately, I am sworn to an oath of secrecy by the Conclave on this matter. I get that. But you and I are trying to help each other, right? Yes. But I would be breaking an oath, and that... I cannot do. Oh, okay. Spirit... You seem to have a history with this voice. This... spirit. She saved my life. Here, years ago, during the war with the Karja. A raid scattered my Werak. I was cut off, alone. I lured the enemy into the Rhyme Drifts, hoping to lose them in the mist, but they endured, so... I took refuge in this cave. That's when I heard a voice. A wanderer. Lost, like me. A spirit of the blue light yet sundered from it. She asked me for aid. She chose me. But I was in no position to help, not with the Karja after me. So she helped me first. By closing a door on the mountain below, one you must have opened to get here. Locked by means similar to those found in this room. It kept the Karja from reaching me. Safe from them. I was able to do as she asked. So the spirit want to help? What did the spirit want from you? She said she was hurt, incomplete. She needed bones, parts not unlike what you'd find in a machine. They were here, in this room. She wanted me to bring them to Thunder's Drum. So I did, and she showed me how to heal her. So began our communion. Okay, what's the communion? She doesn't have a focus. You had a communion with the spirit? Yes. Inside Thunder's Drum is a room like this one, only larger, with an altar. I went there many times to speak with her. What did she say? She told me she was lost and needed my help. She asked questions about our lands, our tribe, and she listened. With Maybe patience. She's the demon. With wisdom. I told her so things long the demon, kept silent the demon. about my family, my dreams, my fears. She never tired of me, never judged. Yes, we kept each other's company. You are giving informations, but what is the spirit? Yes, I don't know if I'll, we already have asked this, but let's go. Aurea, what do you think the spirit is? I see. You are not Banuk, and our songs are not familiar to you. You do not know of the blue light. That which struggles to survive in our hearts and animates the machines. 
the essence of life, and in its purest form, harmony. As the anger of the machines grows, this light has faded from the world, and the spirits it sustains are stranded. That's what she is, a lost soul, cut off from what it needs, lonely, forsaken. I must help her. We must. I'm not sure if I understand, but I want to. That's all I need. So, Daemon. Daemon. The Daemon. What demon. do you know about it? The, the, the I spoke demon. with the spirit many times. First here, then inside Thunder's Drum. The last time. She told me she was under attack by something that could not be seen by mortal eyes. Something evil. She named it the Daemon, and said it needed her power to do what it willed. And she begged me for help, to find a way to destroy her if necessary, to keep it from using her. Uh -oh. That was five years ago. I didn't hear her voice again, until today. Five years. Last what time. kept you from the spirit, after it begged for help? I went to Artok, hoping he could protect her. But the war with the Karja still raged, and before I could reach him, I was ambushed by the Mad Sun King's Kestrels and taken to Meridian in chains. I wasn't able to return to Thunder's Drum until long after the liberation, not until last thaw. You return? Yes, she, she says. You said you returned to Thunder's Drum. That was the expedition that went bad. I saw the funeral. Yes. Once there was finally peace with the Karja, Aratak and I gathered a warrock of great hunters to defeat the daemon. And yet, the old door to Thunder's Drum was gone, replaced by a gate we could not pass, and many machines. We were crushed. Aratak called a retreat, but we had already lost our best. We abandoned them to the snow as we fell back. After. You and I could not agree on what to do next. So I came here, hoping against hope to hear the spirit again. And because of you, I did. But I can ask again about silence. Let's go. About silence? I've told you all I can. There's nothing more I can say. Well, let's go to Thunder's Drum. And this video is 33 minutes. Let's see if I've got this straight. We heard two voices. One you call the spirit, captured somehow by the one you call a daemon. Whatever this daemon is, it's related to the machines and why they've become more dangerous. I want to know how. Both the spirit and the daemon are on a mountain, Thunder's drum. So why don't we go there and figure out what it all means? We can't. Thunder's drum is dangerous more than you can imagine. The daemon has secured it. Besides, our talk won't let us go. As chieftain, he controls the pass to the mountain, and he can't be reasoned with. Sounds like I need a new chieftain. Huh. <laughs> There's an idea that's certain to win us friends. Well. You said you were a hunter. And I'll wager you're not an ordinary one. It's not impossible, even for an outlander. An Aratok couldn't refuse the challenge if you were known among the Werak. <laughs> Wait, uh, me challenge Aratok? I don't want to be chieftain of anything, much less a bunch of Banuk that don't want me. But you want to go to Thunder's Drum, don't you? You heard the spirit. She is suffering. Tormented by the daemon. She longs to be free. And perhaps, when released from her bonds, she can give you the answers you seek. I can't believe I'm agreeing to this. Fine. What do I have to do? Get the Wirak's attention to show the worth of your claim. Win at the hunting grounds. Kill bandits that prey on the cut. Or speak to my friend, Sekuli. You help her. 
We'll definitely get noticed. Is there a tall neck in the area? Yes, near the frost figures. But it's been frozen in ice for generations. What does that have to do with anything? It'll help. Trust me. Maybe even more than I thought. <sighs> if you say so. Do all you can. When the time comes for you to throw your spear at Aratok's feet, I will be there to back your claim. Until then, I'll be here to answer any questions you have about the challenge. Oh, and one more thing. In the box over there is a weapon, like my own. Take it. You may find it useful. Okay. Take the storm's linger. So, must be this weapon. Complete side quest. Save the game. So, for this part, it's okay. I'm just gonna to check what what the, the thing is. So she she was talking about another weapon, but where is the weapon, man? She point to here, but I didn't see any kind of weapon. What's this? I guess the old ones like these animals. Okay, a little bit more sunshine. It almost feels like sunburn. Oh. So, where to go? Let's kind of jump. Go through here and let's just hope the storms is available. If it's available. Okay, so. To go over this one, treasure box. I cannot open generous reward. Thank you that I cannot. Another three skills that I'm going to spend on. Yeah. 
obtained. This is the weapon that I don't want. How can I use it? Let me just see if there is a, a way. Not Oh, okay. No, that, that's not what I mean to to do. Let's grab this. So how how can I switch this? I cannot remember. It's not this way. It's not this thing. It's not this thing. Okay, crafting inventory. It's gonna do make this gun disappear. Yes, 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 yes. So what what is this? Oh, okay. Cool stuff. So I only need to, to find a way to, to save the game and end this episode. Too prepared. They are very far away. So, is there any kind of campfire over here? So, travel. Yes, let's confirm that. So, alright guys, this is going to be the end. This is already with 42 minutes. It's a very, very big episode. So, that's it, man. See you on the next one. Goodbye and take care. Thanks a lot.